Star, and I am an actor, voice actor, writer, filmmaker, director, producer, <laughs> all of the above. Uh, I am based in Orlando, Florida and Atlanta, Georgia. Go back and forth. And yeah, happy to be here today. Thanks for having me. So in 2015 is when I started filmmaking and uh, an actor friend of mine, we had been in the same acting class, we would meet for breakfast about once a month, every couple of weeks, and we would just kind of talk about what we were up to. And I had been doing a lot of research and I, I was feeling frustrated at the time, just being an actor, not getting many auditions, not getting the auditions I wanted. So I said, okay, how can I then have control over my destiny, what I put out into the world? And that's by starting to make my own films. As an actor, you know, you, you can't really control the roles that you're cast and are sent to you to audition for, but as a filmmaker, you can control what you put out into the world. And the stories I really want to tell, the stories that I know resonate with me are the stories of the underdog that perseveres, the stories of people that maybe don't feel like they belong, because that's something I've never felt like I really belonged, whether it be in my culture, in my family, with my friends. I am really weird and goofy and nerdy, and people don't think that about me, and I don't, I even in the industry, that's not how I may look, but I am really just a very weird and goofy, and I love scary, the, the macabre and the scary and the weird, and I've never seen myself portrayed on screen, ever. I've never seen a Middle Eastern person that is not Muslim. I, I wanna bring diversity, but without stereotypes into the entertainment industry. So we actually just get, get to know someone for a person of who they are. Yes, of course, their ethnicity and their cultures and their beliefs are part of them. They're also an individual person with their own likes and wants and dreams. And that's what I want to see explored because that's what I connect to. This is from Jordan. So this is a traditional Bedouin uh, outfit. And uh, so this is, this is often similarly what I see portrayed in, in, in film and TV when we're in the Middle East is, is people wearing similar type outfits to this uh, and this is actually who I am I'm kind of punk rock and and fun and I have red in my hair and I have tattoos and piercings and and I never seen a Middle Eastern person with any of that portrayed <laughs> so I see myself now as really an advocate for for women specifically, for everyone that might be different, for basically anyone that's been pigeonholed, anyone that might be different, but especially for for us women and men that are of a different ethnicity that are being pigeonholed to these really stereotypical roles. And my mission is to create diversity without stereotypes, put those stories out into the world, educate people. Everyone deserves to see themselves truthfully represented on the screen and on the stage. And that is my mission. And I love that comedy can have so much heart and hit you, but then you'll laugh at the, you know, it's, it's therapy to me. So I think it can make such an impact. So my dream would be to be on a, a comedic show, a comedic, uh, whether it be sitcom, streaming comedy, a comedic show that has really relatable, wonderfully written characters. I would, of course, want to write on the show. Do you have one piece of advice to any you know, filmmaker just coming out into this field? To, uh, what would you tell them to kind of get you? I think the most valuable thing for me has been actually like sitting down and thinking about as an actor and as a filmmaker, what are the stories that I want to tell? What do I want to put out into the world? So I would really just advise filmmakers and actors to to really solidify that and and really think about that and like I said it it might take a while to find your voice and that's okay you know don't get daunted for that but definitely definitely spend time exploring that uh, well I think it means being part of a large community of creatives who are making their own way people who are telling the stories that they want to tell and taking it upon themselves to put those stories out into the world. And, and I'm really proud to be part of a community like that.